Hello friends, this video on triangles part 27 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Before watching this video, please make sure that you have watched part 1 to part 26. Let's take one more example. Find x in terms of a, b and c. Where obviously this line, let's both, I'll put this a, b, or let me put pqr because a, b, c is already used. p, q, r, s, t. Given is st is parallel to pq that is given so we have to find the value of x in terms of a b and c since st is parallel to pq we can see that triangle qts is similar to triangle qps we can prove this is angle p that suppose is equal to angle 1 this will be also be equal to 1 dash this is angle 2 this will be 2 dash Correct. So if you see angle R, R comma on both sides, T, if you take T angle here, this we have to take P. If you take angle S here, we have to take angle Q here. So this triangle and this triangle, it will draw it better actually. R, P, Q. Both triangles are similar. So if you see here, triangle P, sorry, R, P, Q is similar to triangle R, T, S. Why? Angle R is equal to angle R, P is equal to angle T, right? And S is equal to angle Q. Thus, these three, two triangles are similar. Since these two triangles are similar, we know that P, R, sorry, let's put all this value, T, S, right? T, S is equal to X, P, Q is equal to A, correct? R, P. RQ. RQ is equal to B plus C. RQ is equal to B plus C and RS is equal to C. Now since these two triangles are similar, we can write the equation and we can find the value of x. This is the approach we will follow. Now let's solve this question. So we'll say that in triangle RPQ and triangle RTS, we see that angle R is equal to angle R by construction because they are all same and we can see that angle T is equal to angle P by corresponding angle correct therefore triangle RPQ is similar to triangle RTS now since this triangle are similar we can say that RQ by PQ sorry RQ by RS RQ by RS is equal to PQ by TS. RQ by RS is equal to PQ by TS. This is RS or B plus C by A is equal to C by X or I can say X is nothing but AC by B plus and that is my answer. Because we were asked to write x in terms of a and c. So what we have done, first we thought what to do. Then we realized that both the triangles are similar. And then if the triangles are similar, then we can compare the sides and we will get x in terms of a, b and c. Let's take one more example. Two poles of height a and b meters are p meter apart. Prove that the point of intersection of the line joining top of each pole is given by AB by A plus B. Let's draw this. This is one pole and this is another pole. Height A and height B. They are B meter apart. So, P meter apart. So this is P. Prove to the intersection of line joining top of each pole. So, let's we join this top of pole A to the bottom of pole B and top of pole B to the bottom of B. We have got this. We have to prove that this height is AB by A plus B, where this is A and this is B. Correct. So this height we have to prove. So let's draw this. So we have to prove that this is AB by A plus B. So let's assume this is H, some height H. We have to prove that H is equal to AB by A plus. How to go about this problem? If you see, let's write this value here. This is A, B, C, D. 
See, if we observe, let's suppose this is F. So, if we observe carefully, this triangle A, E, F is similar to triangle A, C, B. Because angle A is common, this E will be angle C. So, both are similar. Also, we observe that angle E, B, F is similar to this triangle B, D, A. Why? Because B is common. This angle will be equal to this D. Or we can say angle A is equal to angle A and D. So both are similar actually. We have two pair of similar triangles in this diagram. So what should we do? Let's assume this, let's break this actually, the whole AB, right? Let's break this into AF and PB. So let's assume that FB is X. So this becomes P minus X. The total is P. AB is P. So AP is P minus X and PB is X. Now since we have two triangles, one pair of triangle similar and one more pair of triangle, we can write some equation actually in terms of H, A, P and B. And then we can try to find the value of H in the terms of A, P and B. So let's take the first pair in triangle B, E, P and triangle B, D, A. Why I have taken like this? If you see this triangle, right? This is B, this is P, and this is E. B, P, E. P is uh, 90 degree. And angle this B, A, D. A is 90 degree, right? Both the triangles are same. So I can take B, E, P. This way I have taken and BDA I have taken this way, similar way. In the triangle this, we see that angle B is equal to angle B, right? Construction by construction and angle P is equal to angle A, 90 degree. Therefore, triangle BEP is similar to triangle BDA, correct? So what equation we can get from this? That means the sides are also similar. So we know that here if you see BP is nothing but X, right? BA is nothing but P, is P. Now DA is something we know A and EP is H. So equation we'll get is X by P is equal to H by A. This is the first equation we will get. Thus, if you see, we have this x h in terms of x, p, and a. So, we can find the value of x, done deal. So, we need one more equation. So, we will take the other pair of triangles. That is, in triangle, we will take this pair a, e, p, a, e, p, and triangle. We will take a, c, b. Why are you taking like this? Because you know that if you take this way, this is a. This is E, this is P, this is A, this is C, and this is B. 1990. And angle A, angle A, C by construction. So we can say that angle A is equal to angle A by construction. And angle P is equal to angle B is equal to 90 degree. Right? So we can say that both the triangles are similar. Therefore, AEP is similar to triangle ACB. Correct? AEP is triangle similar to ACB. Now, if you see in this triangle, P is H. Correct? CB is B. Correct? AP is P minus X. And AB is AB is P H. So, the equation we will get here is H by B, this side to this side, is equal to P minus X by P. This is my equation 2. I have equation 1, equation 2. To equation in terms of X and H, solving it we can find the value of H. So what we will do? In this equation, X is nothing but, X is nothing but PH by A, right? So here I will write 
एच बाय बी इज इक्वल टू पी बाय पी राइट पी बाय पी माइनस एक्स बाय पी सो एच ऑफ एक्स आर राइट माइनस एक्स बाय पी एक्स इज नथिंग बट पी एच बाय ए दैट इज पी एच बाय ए बाय पी करेक्ट सो वॉट विल गेट हेयर इज दिस गेट्स कैंसिल दिस इज वन सो विल गेट एच इज इक्वल टू बी इन टू वन माइनस एच बाय ए करेक्ट और विल गेट एच इन टू वन प्लस बी बाय ए इज इक्वल टू बी और विल गेट एच इज इक्वल टू ए बी बाय ए प्लस and that is my answer correct so what we have done we have seen that there are two similar triangles in this bep bda ap acb and then we use the proportional theorem to find h is equal to ab by a plus b thank you visit examfear.com to watch free educational videos try free online tests get the best quality study materials study from the best tutors and mentors and much more thanks once again